Meanwhile, many parents and players say they're just frustrated that organized team sports cannot resume until Tier 4 of Honolulu's reopening. That could be next year if things go well. And that is despite the CDC saying that on-field activity is unlikely to cause spread as long as you wear a mask and social distance. Sam Spangler with more tonight in the story that's new at 10. According to the CDC, both masks and social distancing when not playing can be ways for non-professional sports to resume. But Honolulu Mayor Kirk Caldwell still has reservations about what happens off of the field. Members and supporters of various sports leagues and organizations held a small protest outside of Honolulu Halle Wednesday. They're asking Mayor Kirk Caldwell to take organized team sports out of Tier 4. We're already getting restrictions from the city, you know, about like uh, what we can or cannot do. On top of that, we added more restrictions on top of that to make it even safer. So if it's a, an organized sport, you have the organization that can oversee things and make sure that everything, you know, is being done uh, accordingly to, but, you know, to what we have planned. Currently, outdoor sports that don't require a permit, like playing basketball at the park with your friends or family, are allowed up to groups of five and increases to 10 in Tier 3. But organized sports are lumped into Tier 4, which also includes bars and nightclubs. To get to that point, Oahu would need to have fewer than 20 cases per day and less than 1% positivity rate. Still, Caldwell says he won't reconsider moving organized team sports to a lower tier due to concerns regarding crowds and gathering. As mayor, I'd love to open it up to team sports. And we did before, and we saw the result where people weren't following the guidelines. And it's hard to enforce when you have team sports in major city parks all around the island. We asked a doctor who says sports played outdoors can be a safe activity. The coronavirus is a very specific virus. It doesn't last uh, outdoors as much as we think. And science has proven that. Um, you can look at the articles for John Hopkins and they'll show that um, outdoor events has not led to a higher incidence of transmission. Dr. Wu adds he believes the health benefits outweigh any small risk of transmission. I think it's very healthy, not only um, physical-wise, but mental health-wise, to have organized sports. Um, CDC's guideline has provided us with vital information to, to show that outdoor sports have been, um, if conducted safely, are, are done very well. For a link to those CDC recommendations, as well as the full CDC report, you can head over to our website, khon2.com. Sam Spangler, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.